I know times is hard. Folks ain't got nowhere to work. They trying to figure out how to make money. So there are some people who are going into these pyramid schemes or these MLMs, as some folks call them. Yeah, where it's like um, I'm selling a product. I get two people to join in. And then I'm gonna need you to recruit two more people. Oh, uh, okay. And yeah, I'm gonna yeah. need you to recruit two more people. Man. I know times is hard, but good God Almighty, please pretend you got the good sense God gave a Billy Goat. Because those things just do not work. And I've been approached twice by, I think it was Prime America and World Travels. Yo, I almost got got by Prime America. By Prime America. Yeah. Yeah, man. I don't want to. I don't want to go anywhere that I gotta sell people to like make money. You know what I'm saying? I yeah. don't like that. And see, my thing was I was cool with the Prime America thing because they're selling like insurance and all this other stuff and retirement plans. Yeah. So I was like, oh, okay, cool, because I know a lot of old people. Maybe they want to put their money somewhere. Uh, but they were like, okay, we need you to list like a hundred people. Yeah, dude, to, like I need twenty names and numbers. And yeah, I'm, and they were saying we're gonna, you're gonna use. First, they were telling me you're gonna use these people to, you know, to practice your your pitch. And I was like, <laughs> all right, cool, <laughs> cool. I was like, I really don't know that many people because I ain't got a lot of friends. But yeah. you know, I got some numbers in there. You know, we can, <laughs> I can work some out. But then I had a friend call me and was like. They're trying to get me to join your team or to join them. And I was I was, I was sitting there thinking, that's not what this is not why I gave them your number. Yo. My bad. And so I called them and was going off. I got got the exact same way. And I get to do twenty names and numbers. Yeah. And they are like, man, not all of them called me, but some of them called me like, oh, man, will you sign me up for this stuff? This one? I'm like, oh, yeah. man, that was my bad. Yeah. And then, of course, they get you with the you'll make this much amount of money. But before you make all that money, we need you to put your money in. And a wise person always said, don't work for somewhere where the first paycheck comes from you, man. So when they told me that, I was, first, I was I was sitting there thinking, OK, this is me trying to invest in myself, but something, it was the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost or the Holy Guest. Something was like, no, this ain't what this is. This is not what you want to do. So eventually after I went off on the people <laughs> for calling people on their behalf and not on mine, I was, I'm done. Yeah. And then it was so funny because the day I was supposed to have my first like pitch meeting or whatever, <laughs> it rained that day. That was a sign right there. Yeah, it rained that day. And let me tell you what it is about me and water. I love it. And when it rains, I listen. Call me weird. But when it's raining, some, something's going on. Something, Either something ain't right or something's about to go, something's about to go wrong or something's about to go right. And when it rained, and it was raining hard that day. To where um, it was kind of difficult for me to drive for Uber or whatever. Yeah, it was like, bread, don't do this. Yeah, it was some, something slowing me down here. It's the Prime America thing. So <laughs> <laughs> for real. And so I called them, was going off, tell them, you know, I'm not going through with the meeting, you know, just screw you and all this other stuff. But please, y'all, please just do not. Because now it's, oh, this tea. Oh, this um, the, the these, these oils, these all this other stuff. Especially black folks, when for some reason we've we've reached a stage where we're like, you know, we want to be healthier and yeah. all this other stuff, and we need to detox and all that foolishness. Yeah. Something else, which I've is been stupid. Let, let me say this, and then your body automatically detoxes itself. That's what the liver is for. Now it's okay to buy food products to help the liver along just to give it some ad, you know some additives to it mm -hmm. but you don't have to spend 30 40 dollars for a tea which the only thing you're going to be doing is just pooping you can go to the Walgreens or to Walmart and get you some uh some saline or some milk and magnesia that you know to do all of that but that's basically <laughs> what the tea is and then they're talking about you know, they selling uh protein powders and all this you don't have to do that Go to if you want to detox yourself, go to the produce section 
which funny during when everyone was buying all the grocery and stuff, produce section was still fully stocked. Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, okay, ain't nobody going to buy the fruits and the vegetables milk, that milk. naturally has protein in it and it'll help you go. Yeah. Yeah. But what was you saying? What was you about to say? I'm gonna say something else when it when it comes to those like pyramid schemes and things. I've been seeing a lot more lately those like cash app contests and stuff on Facebook. Have you yeah. seen those? And I knew a girl, this has happened like a couple of months ago. I knew a girl that did that. Where the girl was like, Give me your information, all this other stuff, and I cash up you the money. And then when a girl goes back into like her Facebook and stuff, all her information had been changed. Dang. And she didn't even get the money. I was, I was like, I would have felt better for you if you had the money yeah. and just start your Facebook over. But now you got to start your Facebook over, and you don't have any money. And then the people were going; they changed the information. Then was going in and um, telling all her friends in her friend list, you know, with the same scam with the cash apps now getting everybody right. I know times is hard, but yeah, yeah. you ain't got to do all of that. I feel like some of these scammers, like, if they put that energy into, like, some legit money, it'd probably, like, work out better. Because some of them, be like, do real, like, ingenious things to scam people. And I'm like, bro. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, well, you're actually really smart. With me, <laughs> with me, I don't see how anybody can fall for, I, I just, I, it, if never it's been too scammed. good to be true, it is. Yeah. So don't don't fall for the okie doke. 